Hello, hello, everyone. The stream is starting. How's everyone doing today? Now that we're just about settled in, everyone get your cat snacks and your water, and we will get to it. For anyone who doesn't know me, my name is Black Cat. I do Path of Exile content as well as other RPG, uh, open world, and dungeon crawler content. Today we are here with our pyroclast mine of sabotage, saboteur, shadow, character. We hit 90 last stream, and we've been able to pick up a few new cool things. I grabbed the divinarius, two of them, that I said I was going to last stream. Now we are quite powerful. We have most of what we need now. Oh gosh, I forgot. My flask still needs to be better. <laughs> it's not very good. It could really use with having some quality on it pretty badly. It'll be fine. Fine. What could possibly go wrong? Nothing could go wrong. Right? Right? <laughs> Uh. Okay, so we have the safe house to do first. I'm trying to finish up my atlas right now. I think I'm a little over halfway done now. Been so busy lately, so I haven't been getting a lot of stuff done off of stream, sadly, but. I'm working on it. We're at 53% XP. Okay. Let's see how much we get from this. Sorry for the lack of videos lately, for anyone who's noticed. I, on the uh, Highlights channel, actually on the stream channel too, I've... Been very, very busy with uh, day job stuff as of late, so it's made it hard to keep up with the channel as well. I do want to keep doing it though. Nothing, I don't intend to stop, but uh, I am probably going to be reducing the number of videos I've put out per day. Start up per day. Uh, gosh, I can't put out more than one video a day. <laughs> I'm putting out five videos a week, and I'm going to be dropping down to three. I wish I could say otherwise, but that's just going to be the that's just going to be the way it has to be. Hopefully, when uh, things have stabilized a little bit, I'll be able to do videos. I mean, ideally, I'd love to put a video every single day. And like have three regular streams. That's that's not coming. That's not coming to fruition yet. Got some other stuff to do before that happens. The bright side, though, I think we're only four followers off of uh, having enough for affiliate, which is really exciting. Not wait to be able to do that, because for anyone who doesn't know, affiliate is the level where a Twitch streamer can actually start to earn money and, like, have subscriptions and all of that, which kind of helps transition it from a fun thing you do for just yourself to an actual job where you can rely, spend more time on it because you're financially stable enough to do so. That is ultimately where I want to go, because I really would like to be able to entertain people as a living. That'd be really fun. Streaming is quite enjoyable, so... We'll get there. Might just take a while. I mean, it's gonna take a while, but that's, that's life. Life is long. We are long livid. I'm not too worried about Russian. Get there.
Hello, Jorgen. Mamu, I've come to Jorgen. Not a lot of Mastermind XP. I'll swap a div card with a random one. I will need to... Div cards, then. Give me div card. Give me shitty div card. Here, I'll take one eighth of a chaos and put that in. Give me a doctor. That is worse than what I put in. Okay, so we got... You know, for a lightning conversion and melee build, this actually would be really good. Lightning damage, physical damage with attacks to convert, elemental damage with attack scales, and global crit strike chance. And strength. What can I get for it? Oh. Uh... I mean, there is increased effect of non-damaging ailments, which would help with the shock lightning damage. I think attack and cast would probably be better, though. Usually attack speed is, is useful in areas like this. There still is an open prefix slot to put life on. Or to put another offense prefix on. What do we have? Oh, I could add a lightning damage with tax to it. Melee damage or non-channeling skills. Lots of good options. I'll add a non-channeling skills one to it. Oh yeah, that's really good now. <laughs> yeah, I mean we have a tier we have two tier ones, including the crafted one. We have two tier twos, a three and a six. That's not that bad. Price that late. Also, I need to start using scarabs. I don't freaking use any scarabs. <laughs> it's not. It's not very useful. The fact that I just kind of ignore them. I can have two of these. Here, let's have like a lot of abyss. Try that. Less recovery or less curse or less aura effect. Oh, and crit reduction. Uh, I'll take this one. You did not get hit too much. Dropped items with rarity are converted to scarabs. Ooh. Uh, that's, that feels like the making of something really, really nice. What, okay, what can we do with this that would actually make it, like, super powerful? What drops a lot of rare items? Well, I guess, I guess the immediate answer to that would be Rogue Exiles. They drop a lot of rare items. I don't want to use up all my rare exile embers. On my price checker. Let's see. What are these? Throw a 10 C a piece. Hmm. Because what I could do is I can swap these. And if I put a Rogue Exile here, 
Oh, I guess more pack size isn't useful in Rogue Exiles. There's one to modifier tier. Oh, I guess it doesn't increase the modifier tier for for the basic ones, but it does increase it for other ones. Maybe because this one just can't have a, bi a better tier. I mean, the chance that I'll be able to get 10 Seaworth of Scarabs is pretty high. I can try that. Well, if the pack size and the... If the pack size and the modifier tier aren't going to help me, I might as well put it on this one instead. Reduce modifier tier. Yeah, reducing the modifier tier on the fire damage might be a good idea. Anything, anyways, the increased pack size one, I need to put something. Pack wants to drop abyssal. That's actually, there's an idea there. What I can do is. Wait, did I add the scarabs to this? I don't know if I remember to add the scarabs to this. Well, we'll find out in a second. I forgot to add the scarabs. Damn it. I'm gonna say that, like, I could uh, have my abyss scarabs maybe mesh with the added abyss monsters, but. Never mind. Anyways, let's see what the exiles do for scarabs. Oh, there's three scarabs. Oh, why are we so laggy today? What's going on? No! Okay, I knew that was bad. I knew that was going to go badly and I didn't move. Just the, why are we lagging so much? Oh, don't teleport me backwards away from the delirium, please. I need that. Did I just get... I just got rubber-handed twice in a row. That's really not good. Oh god. That is a pile. What is that, a divine shrine? They're not taking... Are they taking damage? That must be a divine shrine. There it is. Okay. Now I don't have to worry about anything. Yay, divinity! Oh my gosh, I'm getting rubber banded like crazy. I hate this. Stop rubber banding me! Stop that. I don't think I'm going to make five. Oh, tier five, I should say. Because I'm walking backwards towards the delirium. Never a good sign. Oh yeah, I can't go in there because I have to go talk to the, uh, the people I killed. Ray's talk to the people I killed is a bit strange, but... Okay, so... Where are we at? Sulfite Scarabs. And, uh... What are you? Your Cartography Scarabs? Aku are Strongbox Scarabs. You're way more important than that. Rin to get me some more... Progress. 
then steal a large amount of large, large amount of unveiled things. Uh, no, 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 no. Okay. Possessed abyss monsters are scary. Do not like. Unsubscribe. But speaking of which, remember to subscribe to the YouTube channel for highlights or the uh, streaming VOD channel. Link in the description on YouTube. So I guess you're probably seeing the VOD already in that, that case. And follow the Twitch channel so you know when we're going live. Lots and lots of scarabs. My inventory is full of scarabs. I'll have to come back for the rest of it. Yep, I have two. Crap away. Okay, 4.6 div. How much is a div right now? Div. Div. Not bad. Excuse me, a div is 100c? That would be 60 then. Ugh. Yeah, div and 60c. Or 4 div and 60c. Okay. A div. I don't want to put away the scarabs yet. I want to see which scarabs I get. From... Oh, I got a rat, uh, a rat ember. They're good. Wait, there's a D. Deer. I love that. I love deer. They're great. Arabs. I spy with my little eye a scarab man. Okay. Laboratory. This is a tier 6, but it really doesn't feel like anything. I guess my powers have gone up a lot. Having the two Divinarius really helps, because, uh, I mean, one of them I should probably not have, because it's 155% spell damage instead of 200, the amount. But the reason I picked that one is because it ma it almost max rolled crit strike multiplier, which would be really good for bossing specifically. So that's 60 to 200, and I got 98. So it probably I probably should remove that, especially because like even the life is low, too. This one, on the other hand, is pretty good. Well, okay, the life and mana aren't amazing, but the spell damage is great, and the critical strike chance is above average. Actually, no, it's average. The, no, the critical strike chance is above average. The critical strike multiplier is about average. Okay, what is there here? Exciting. Oh boy. Maybe a bit too exciting. 
Why is everything running so badly today? Oh god. What am, what am I doing that is making everything run badly? I don't see anything that should be doing that. Oh, we're getting an update soon. Cool. Yeah, I'm not aware of the patch notes, so I'm kind of curious what they're adding. Hopefully the run won't be down too long. Yes, scarabs. We've got 30 minutes. Lots of time to do. Hello, friends. I left that corpse there earlier, specifically, so that I have the extra uh, Gravekeeper's boon right now. But it's consuming corpses' life and mana. I don't know how much it matters, but it is kind of nice to have that just in the chamber as an option. What did we actually get first? Oh, I didn't get that. Got a lot of scarabs from doing this. Got a lot of scarabs from doing this. Okay. I don't totally know which ones are the most valuable. Usually the wing ones are more valuable. That one's not valuable. <laughs> Version monsters. Additional... Hurricanes 40 to 60 additional clusters of mysterious barrels. Uh, okay. Nope. Breach splinters. Nope. Champions. Nope. Absolute chance to be duplicated. 5C. Breaches and area each contain a Breach Lord. Oh, that's worthless. Ew. Which one of these actually have value? Apparently not many of them, if any. I guess there's just so many Scarabs now that it's kind of diluted their usefulness. I'll shoot. Okay, so that wasn't really worth using the Exiles Ember, sadly. Yeah, well. Already have. We have here. Oh yeah, we have thirteen. These will be sixteen, though. Well, we're gonna keep working on the lower tier ones just so that we can finish off this stuff. As soon as we finish this off, we're gonna have like a lot of extra points to work. Blast charges. I am a mind build, so element reflection does nothing. Courthouse is the better map, so I'll pick that one. A lot of tw Yeah. Spawn a tormented spirit on death. Hmm. 
Okay, increase back size and grant a buff on death is really not good. <laughs> that is really, really not good. Sure. Okay, good opening. Immediately into the laboratory. Okay. This will give me a whole bunch. A bunch of progress. Oh, I don't get lost. Well, I'm never going to get lost again like I did in that, that lab or in that laboratory, that library map that we did early in the season. That was really bad. An entire minutes in the library trying to find the, the next level. That's just so bad. Jorgen, I don't have much time for you. Or give me the Arabs. No. No, you're not fast enough. I'll fight, yep. I'll fight Scarabs, I'm fine ditching you in exchange for progress. Just Sulfite Scarabs aren't that valuable these days. I mean, they weren't really that valuable before now, but... Oh, that's... That spirit must be one of the explodey ones. Anarchist, I think. Ooh, a haunted by. Oh, nice. I don't have very many yet. Can I double up? No, I cannot double up on Gravekeeper's Blessing, which is the thing that eats corpses for, for health and life. No, not health and life. Life and mana. Health and life are the same thing. Love the pack size this league. It's so nice. Uh-oh. 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 Okay. I, I managed to save it. Um, Probably not for very long, though. Oh, hordes. Wait, why are there hordes everywhere? That must have been what the scarab was that I used. I'll have to come back and get the stuff. Is that a cartographer's orb that dropped? I'm trying to pay attention to the map because there's so many hordes everywhere that I'm like, is this... Is it over? <laughs> Is this the horde or is this a horde? I mean, really, the amount of hordes is uh, fortifying. Horde. Boating. Yeah. Oh, adds Harbinger items. Oh, we got a synthesis. Synthesis. Wow, that's awful. That's really not a good synthesis modifier. I don't think. That's not a good synthesis modifier. We're definitely going to hit 91 today. 100%. I mean, ideally I should be doing higher level stuff, but having more Atlas passive points will make everything more valuable I do in the future. So it's an investment in the future.
rid of all the problems so I can actually talk to Leo in peace. I'll need that. Twenty minutes. We probably have enough time for at least two minutes. Oh, it's going to be down for 10 minutes. That sucks. I guess we can always take an early intermission if needed. Anything? No, we're basically done here. Why is something June like every map? I see her way more now that we don't have the master missions to, like, pick who we're getting. The system just works so much better for it. I'm not promoting orbs anymore. Four C. The orb. Three C. Wow. Okay, those aren't getting sold. I'm gonna use those. Absolutely not worth selling. Where was I wanting to? Tempted to cut off the ritual stuff. Like I don't, I don't really. I don't know if Ritual is a good character. Modifiers in the Lantern are higher here. Go to modifiers and monsters in your map. I don't know why you would want this, because Embers of the All Flame cannot be found on your map, and Embers are what's worth the money. I'm just going to start working on getting Delirium in every map. Er. No. These don't have projectiles, okay. I'm not going to give increased projectiles to something that actually has projectiles. Badness. <laughs> I don't need, like, tornado shot archers in my map. Thank you very much. Because it might as well be tornado shot if there's... if they're shooting seven things. Since they start with one, and then they get plus six. Ooh, there is a monument right beside the sulfite. Interesting. Ooh, synthetic fury. I think that one's actually valuable. Good spirit possessing that one. Ren, what are you doing? Uh, okay, I don't need any more. I don't need any more intervention stuff. I already got enough. Intervention. Sorry, man, more. You're vicious, too. Eh. Not, that's not very good. I mean, if I could move him to intervention, that would be nice. I'd much rather move him to intervention. And Rin is cartography, which is good. So I think... Tempted to release him and see if Rin will pull him in. I'm gonna try that. Rin, will you take him in? No, you just give intervention. Okay. And I'll release you because as soon as the board ticks once, we will get that safe house. So we'll be able to do that next. Ooh, we have uh, fumes on both of these. 
think I see him. That's the, uh, Doom Spirits one. That's how that works? I can't remember. But if that's how it works, then it's good to kill things near it, because there will be a bonus on them. I got a lot of them that time. This this build is just really good for that. Just hitting a lot of things very quickly. I got two currency ones. That's really nice. What did I just get? I swear something came out of the stuff and hit me. Oh, it dropped a, uh, okay, it dropped a, um, uh, minor shrine for me. Ooh, that's dangerous. Fuck. Pretty resistant against basically anything that isn't chaos damage at this point, so that's good. Ooh. I also have enough damage that I can kill anything that gets close to me before it can really attack me. Like the Syndicate people. Okay. Who do I want where? Here are the leaders. How are you up? I can't. Actually, I wouldn't mind moving Hillock to a different area called the Trey. Oh, wait, that. Right, I should have done that on Giannis. Oops. I should have betrayed Hillock with Giannis. Or no, that wouldn't have worked. That would have just gone rid of Hillock. I think my brain did a fucky wucky. I don't want to carry a giant staff. That's a tier one cold damage to spells. Ew, but it has accuracy. Uh, a, st a physical... Not physical. A, a melee spell... No, that... No, that doesn't work. Too many overlapping things. There's Shrine, and in we go. I always try to get as many, th kill as much stuff as I can. I know I can just run to the end if I want, but I want to get as much XP as I can. And also, I mean, the more stuff you kill, the mo more chance you have of getting full drop. Oh, hello. Are you over here? Oh, okay. Okay. Give ritual scrubs. And you give Kalgurian currency, so you're more important. A more important. Dimension members have retreated to their safe house. We fought them. 
I don't really care if they retreat to their safe house after I fight them. You know, I fought them first. I'm trying to push this to go a little bit faster, and hopefully I can do the next map quickly so that we get it in in time before we break. I need to go, I assume, over here. Ow. Stop! Stop rubber banding me! That's twice in 30 seconds. Okay, good enough. Go back out. Now for the annoying, now for the annoying silo map. I oh, have these. We'll do the intervention safe house after the patch. All right, self intoxication. Oh, detonate corpses. Why did that happen? And spirit. And strong box, nice. I like strong boxes. Yes, my horde of minions, yes. <laughs> Oh, the Convert on Death is so cool. It's not necessarily really useful, but it's very cool. Oh, I have a horde of blue minions on my side. Yes! Fight for me! Fight for me, my minions! Yes! Yes! Okay, that's the side. And... What did I not get? It opens as soon as you hit everything. I must have missed one somewhere. Maybe I did get it in the end, I don't know. I think time ran out. And trying. Okay. Bye, Valencia. Bye, Valencia. I said goodbye, Valencia. Thank you. I love having a horde of minions in this. This is great. <laughs> and they're a blue pack, too. That's so much fun. So many offensive auras. Not too many. Just perception. Just precision. Hey, they're crit resistant too. Nice. <laughs> My crit resistant field of monsters. How long do they convert for? I figured they had, like, a time limit. I mean, it's cool. This can per convert permanently? I, I guess it's only a limited effect anyways. How useful it can be. Wait. I want to go here. I 
Hey, Ron. Glad to see you made it. Can I do a, a map really fast? Can I do toxic... Can I do fast? Encrypt. I hate dungeon, so let's do dungeon really fast. Drop down... Um... No, whatever. I'm just going to go through it. If I get kicked out in the middle of, of the map, I get kicked down in the middle of the map. We'll see. The patch is going to come through in, like, four minutes. And their servers are going to restart then. minutes. Hate this map anyway, so I don't want to spend too much time in here. Uh, oh, strong box, nice. Having having a chance for my sulfite veins to just spit out strong boxes is really nice. I like Doom Spirits. I didn't realize it was so good. Oh God. Oh boy, that was a lot of lag. It's 100% on GGG's side. I wonder if the patch has anything to do with, like, why everything's so laggy. Like, maybe they're partially pushing the restart to, like, get the servers working better or something. Or it could just be not none of that and... We can hope that it'll be better later, after it's had a chance to restart. Maybe there'll be less people on, too. Oh! Hot! Oh. I didn't even get to say hi to Omniphobia before he died. Crack converts on death on something. Not really paying attention to what, though. I thought this was a smaller map, I admit. I'm slightly worried. There we go, okay. That's the end. Hello, Brutus. Goodbye, Brutus. Oh, with about a minute remaining. Okay, we have a 60% chance for our maps containing a... Uh, Air delirium. That's nice. Synthetic theory valuable? No, it's for very hard to find something that's valuable. As far as the embers go. The main embers that are valuable are the uh wealth ones. Where there's things that drop currency. Which makes sense. Especially seeing as there is a, uh, a scarab that makes it so that you don't consume your scarabs when you use scarabs. Just consume it. Yeah, it's going to be down for 20 minutes. Or 10 minutes, not 20 minutes.
Oh, there's actually some notable things going on in the patch, too. Let me bring this up for us so you can see what I'm looking at. Okay, well, we are having an impromptu patch notes break, I guess, seeing as we're going to wait till the servers come back. We've got about 10 minutes. This is interesting. We're getting seven new types of scarabs. Scarab, uh, Abyss Scarab of Profound Death, Blight Scarab of Invigoration, Breach Scarab of Resonant Ca Cascade, Essence Scarab of Adaptation, Tormented Spirit of Possession, that doesn't, that's very confusing, seeing as Tormented Spirits are just Possession. Scarab of Radiant Storms and Scarab of Wisps. Oh. Oh, Radiant Storms! Oh, I think that's, uh, so Elva does this thing when you're inside the Vault Temple, where there can be storms in there. There's four different storms, one is like all... If you get hit by the storm, everything that drops for a short while becomes is corrupted. There's another one that if you get hit by the storm, your uh, item rarity and quantity goes up. That might be what that is. Legion Scarab of Eternal Conflict now has Legion monsters in area, gain increased difficulty and reward for each time they're broken out. What? For each time they are broken out. Each time? There must be some way to break them up multiple times then that I'm not aware of. Tempests, uh, which were the Alva thing I just mentioned, and Affliction Wisps are now considered as extra content and will no longer be present in map areas with the Back to Basics Atlas Keystone passive allocated. I assume Back to Basics just gets rid of extra content. Add 300 more foiled Tier 17 Valdos. Elder Garden can no longer be targeted by Delirium Demons, as they could fail to transition phases if they're under the effects of Delirium when Delirium Encounter ends. Oh, so I think that means that they can't get Delirium effects now? Because, like... Sometimes rares will just, like, freeze in place, and they'll have, like, a demon that is floating above them that attacks you. I think that's what it's referring to. Mm -hmm. Update description of Abyssal Assailant's Challenge. To clarify that Stygian inspires defeated must be those at the end of Abyss Abysses. Of Abysses. Beating those spawned through all flame of ember of abyss does not count to challenge. Oh, because okay, so people were trying to force the challenge to be done faster. Oh, I don't see why that's a bad thing. I mean, maybe they don't want it to in inflate the price. Well, it sounds like it never worked to begin with. Oh, so there's that. It is clarified that that it didn't work. Transfigured gems are no longer displayed as results when searching the base version of a skill gem on the trade website. As in the, in the listing, or if you search Pyroclast Mines, does it not show you that Pyroclast Mines of Sabotage exist? If it doesn't show you they exist, that's stupid. If it just throws them amongst the basic skill gems, that's a problem, probably. They're kind of different. Eternity Shroud uh, properly drops some Uber Uber Elder now. Monster packs in from all flames that were supposed to drop influenced items now do it properly. 
fixed unopenable strong boxes in T17 maps. Fixed some uh, necropolis corpses being unable to be collected. Fixed scare of calcification could imprison non natural inhabitants in maps sub areas such as monsters and betrayal and research encounters. <laughs> Wait, so the there could be <laughs> the <laughs> the assassins could just of the immortal syndicate could just be accidentally turned. To like to be frozen in crystal. <laughs> That's funny. Fixed a bug where the suppressed spell damage dealt to you is unlucky on Volgrace was applying for all spell damage dealt to you. Not just suppressed spell damage. Okay, so that's a bit of an error. Fixed a bug oh, this is important probably. Fixed a bug where the trigger and mind skill granted by detonate mines is triggered when you're moving. Passive skill mastery would override skill bindings. This triggered version can no longer be bound to the skill bar. Oh. Basically, you can't detonate mines manually. That's a thing. I think. Version scarabs were fucky. Private leagues. Boom div cards weren't turn inable. Necropolis lockers are now available in guild hideouts. Desync on Vault Domination from Dominating Blow. Fix the bug where you cannot control right click the skill icon of a banner skill when rebinding skills or within the character panel to use that skill. You can use control right click to use a banner skill or to use a skill from the skill selection. Oh, that's that might be a secret hotkey. <laughs> Fixed a bug where you couldn't edit sockets in controller input mode. Uh, added fixed the bug where advanced modifier descriptions were not visible when viewing items in your stash in controller. Um, issues with controller, issues with controller, client crash, and UI for the Night Lotus Ever Tree would sometimes not display. So TLDR, Vulgrace now works as intended, so it's a little it does not as good as before. Journey Shroud drops properly, leave all those, bunch of new scarabs. PC servers are restarting now. Let's see. Oop. Oh. No server. Oh.
Oh. Might be up now. Based on the fact that the... The thing on the website disappeared for server restarting. <laughs> Top comment on the patch notes is, delete magic find. It does seem like a bit of a boring mechanic. I mean, I've never really used a magic find any. I mean, I've probably used, like, I've used, like, Sunspire boots when I'm leveling. I've never, like, intentionally tried to do that. Like, in a leveled character. Okay, so while we're waiting for Path of Exile to get shit together... Sorry, I just got distracted, because it looks like Pal World got a small update. Nothing too exciting. Okay, so while they're, the servers are restarting, I'm going to run to the washroom. Here be. Okay, welcome back, everyone. I think we're we're all updated and ready to go. I did update. Oh my gosh. I... I'm going to pause the recording until I actually have this set up properly. I'm pausing the VOD for a second so that it actually has an end to it. Going to going to end the stream here till the technical difficulties with Path have passed because we've already had almost half now we've had an entire half an hour of technical issues now. So going to restart the stream when and if it decides it wants to work tonight. If it decides it does not want to work tonight, then I will not restart the stream. Unfortunately. I'll I'll see if I can do another stream some other time this week at, like, at random. So, uh, if you want to see another stream, I would suggest that you follow the channel. <laughs> Thank you so much for everyone who has watched so far today. I appreciate you very much. I might be back in ten minutes if it works. Otherwise, I might not come back tonight. We'll have to see what happens. Thank you all. For everyone who's here and has been here, I appreciate you very much. And I hope you have a great night. I don't see you.